Hey guys, um, standard welcome. Um, I'm just going to give you a couple of minutes to uh, get yourself organised. We've got five minutes before we kick off anyway. Um, so I'll just make sure that I catch up too. If you are joining us tonight for strength and conditioning, you may see it's just me. It is just me tonight. Don't worry, Anna's fine. Uh, she just left me to roll with it and throw a few bit weights about. Um, so hopefully you're going to still stick it out with me. Um, you don't actually need any equipment if you don't want to. So you can either go pure body weight or there is the weighted option too. So I've got you covered, guys. Don't panic if you haven't got any equipment at home. You can still participate in the workout and hopefully it will still give you a bit of a hit as well. Um, now, with strength and conditioning, the main aim behind it is, well, it's a lot of uh, repetitions, tempo-based training. Tonight, a little bit different uh, compared to last Thursday night, strength and conditioning, which was a pure tempo hit. Uh, this is, I've got four methods that we're going to play with, okay? Oh, <laughs> Claire, you've just finished doing body pump. This this could be a little bit interesting then for you. You can go pure body weight if you want to. Don't worry about it if you haven't got equipment. If you have got equipment, you can make it a little bit more intense. Um, I'll start with equipment. I may bottle it and bail because it, it's it's a bit of a brutal training uh, program. But you work at your own levels, okay? So if you need to take a break or a recovery, by all means, go for it. I can't see you anyway. So if you wanted to bail on me, go for it. Sit back, watch. Um, but the main objective and aim behind tonight's session. We're going to work like we did last week with blocks. So we're going to focus on legs by doing a squat block. We're going to focus on chest and biceps by doing press ups or chest press, which also will kick the uh, biceps into gear as well. We'll do another leg set where it comes to lunges. So again, hitting the glutes and the hamstrings and the quads. And then our last set will be um, triceps. So we're going to hit the whole body. Um, if you want equipment, you can either set yourself up with a bar. Um, you could also do it with a plate. If you don't, if you want something and you haven't got that kind of equipment, then just hold a plant pot or something in front of you. Front load, front load will be fine. But everything has got a body weight option, so panic ye not. Um, yeah, Claire, you take it steady. I don't want you hurting yourself. This is where I press a button and it all goes horribly wrong. Oh, so far, so good. Not too bad. I'm going to scoot back that way. Uh, again, I'm loving my tripod. The angles I've got to put it at and all sorts is all over the place. Um, so when I get down to the ground, hopefully you'll be able to see me. I will try and avoid headbutting my uh, pedal. Um, but you guys, just make sure you've got a bit of space around you. This doesn't involve a lot of movement. You're literally going to be on the spot. Uh, the most movement you're going to make is when you get yourself into a backward stepping lunge. Okay. Uh, still got a minute or two before we kick off, guys. So weight on the bar whatever you fancy um they are big blocks of work i think on average about eight minutes and 20 seconds um the format we're rolling with tonight you've got pulse play ply, uh, pause and plyo the four p's i've been sitting and writing all sorts of different formats this will be my third run through of it okay run through number one was horrendous and because I sat on the sofa and wrote it up thinking oh that'll be okay easy yeah it wasn't um run through two again pretty brutal so run through three I've tweaked it a little bit more and I'm hoping it still gives us the benefit of the training without absolutely killing us all off okay but you guys you can be um my guinea pigs you're like my little test pool of people so We'll get started in a minute. Um, just make sure you've got the space around you. Block number one is going to be squats. So just make sure if you load the bar, put it on the meaty part of your back. You could always front load it with a plate if you wanted to. Or pure body weight is fine. Okay, so I'm just going to scoot back there. Now, the way we're going to roll with this, it's a 2020, 2020, 2020, 2020. Now, what does that mean? It basically means 20 seconds of work with a 20 second recovery, back to work, recover, work, recover, work, recover. We're going to go around in that loop five times in total. OK, so we'll be doing each block 
I lie, but the majority of the blocks five times in total, hitting the four styles of training that I've just told you about. So we've got pulse, play, pause, and plyo. Okay, I'll go through it with you because I'm actually going to take part in the workout. How it feels? Well, we're all going to be in the same boat. I'm going to start with the bar on my back. If I carry on with it, brilliant. If I don't, never mind. Um, I'm just going to get the music playing. Again, if you give me an idea as to whether it's loud enough, not loud enough. Again, I'd rather you hear me over the music. If you want to put the radio on at home or whatever, go for it. So how many of us are giving it a go tonight? Are we all giving it a go? We're all showing a bit of a watch. We've got 18 people with me at the moment. No, that's all good. So, team, we're going to get the bar on the meter part of our back. We're going to go through this five times in total. Four different methods of training, five rounds. Ready to get it going? Get the bar onto the meaty part of the back. Should have probably pressed the star button first, shouldn't I? So, low bar, feet outside the hip distance. And we're going to start with bottom half pulses. So, sit in that low squat, drive the knees wide and keep the chest lifted. Drive the elbows under the bar and brace the core. Really squeeze your glutes to get the maximum out of this training. Right, recover. 20 seconds, chill out. It's going to start off okay, okay? So don't get too complacent just yet. We've got 10 seconds, then the second round is play. Play is single movement. So you ready? Three, two, one, single squats. Again, body weight, all weighted. If you've got a weight but it's not a barbell, then you can always hold it in front of you, so front load it. Now this is where you all hope I can tell the time, and me too, to be honest. Right, one more rep, recover. 20 seconds, easy peasy. So far, so good. Third block of work, or third session, this is the, the pause. Now the pause is going to be a devil's chair. So we're going to sit in a low squat. Get ready to drop and hold for 20. Three, two, one. Drop and hold. So drive the knees out nice and wide. Elbows push through under the bar, chest lifted, and just hold it there. Breathe through it. 10 seconds, team. Can we get a recovery? Okay, follow the ocean. Three. Two, one, recover. Okay, so we're not done. This is the last move in block one, and then we repeat it all over. You've got squat jumps. So squat jumps, non-loaded. If you've got a bar, definitely non-loaded. You ready to go, team? Three, two, go. So squat jumps. This is your plyo round. So your plyo round is where we're going to jump nice and high, soft knees. Now your option, if you want to take the impact out, is squat and calf raise. Squat and calf raise. Three, two, one, recover. 20 seconds, we go through it again. So exactly the same. We start off with our pulse round. So get ready to go in 10 seconds. Nice low bottom half pulses. You ready guys? Three, two, one. Go, so bottom half pulses. Really drive the knees wide and make sure you're dead center with that pulse. With the squat, you may favor one side over the other. So make sure you're really centralizing those bottom half squats. Three, two, one, up you get. Keep the bar on the back if you want to, or just put it down. You've got another 15 seconds and then we play. So our single movements. Now, are you feeling a little bit warmer in this second round? I know my legs are starting to feel a little bit warmer. Ready team? Play. Single movements. Now we get to nail our squat technique because there's a big focus on it, obviously, because that's what we're doing. So what's really key is in these single squats, do not lock your knees. Do not lock. Last few seconds. Three, two, hold. 20 seconds, all yours. Then we're gonna drop and hold. Chance to 
also have a chat with you. Uh, while it's in the living room with you. Are you ready? Five seconds, we're going to drop and hold. Really squeeze your butt. Ready? Drop and hold. So squeeze. Now, you're tensing your glutes for stabilisation and to activate them as well. Because as well as hitting our quads, we want to get our butt working too. So squeeze it. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Right, you can pop the bar there. You've got 15 seconds and then we're squat jumping. How's that feeling? Easy? What do we reckon? Right, get ready to go in five, four, three, two, go. So you've got your squat jumps. Again, use your arms and get as much height out of it as you possibly can. Throw them up overhead, chest up. You've got 10 more seconds. This is where we can get a little bit of a kick and the most out of our heart rate. So make the most of it. Recover. Bar goes onto the meaty part of the back again. We're hitting block three. So hopefully you get a little bit of fatigue in the body. That's what we're aiming for, it's overload training. Ready? Three, two, one, drop and pulse. Now we're hitting our legs with multiple different formats of training. So they don't know what to come next. They're constantly having to react to the different styles of training. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Take the breath. We're hitting our play round. I'm hoping you're starting to feel it. Stepping up a gear now. Five more seconds. Push the knees out nice and wide. Ready? Go. Single squats. Single squats. Now the benefits of this style of training is where the tone comes in. No, you're not going to get your heart rate up massively high, but it's not always about this. This is how you sculpt in your body. So the curves and the definitions come from this. Recover. Right, we're hitting the halfway point. So we're halfway through block two. We've got our sit and hold coming. Get ready. Five. Four, three, two, drop and hold. Now make sure your butt is no lower than knee line. And again, you're not letting your chest drop. Use your core, so brace it. And make sure you're sitting and you're holding. Five seconds. Four, three, two, come out of it. We've got our jump round coming in. So plyo coming in. Are you ready for this, guys? In five, four, three, two, go. So your plyometric round. Get the height in the legs. Get the height. Come on, you got it. Ten seconds to go, team. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two. One, right. The next round, I'm gonna cut our recovery time. So the last two rounds, we're not gonna get 20 seconds to recover. We're only gonna get 10 seconds to recover. So get ready to go. 20 seconds of work, just a 10 second recovery. Ready to pulse. Three, two, drop and pulse. Nice and low. So instead of having an equal work to rest ratio, we're cutting the rest ratio. So it's a two to one. Ooh, drive through the heels, get the most out of those glutes. Five, four, three, two, come out of there. You've got 10 seconds now. Single squats coming your way. Ready? Go. Single squats, play. Don't let those knees fold in, keep them driving out. 10 more seconds, team. Five seconds. 
Come on, get the depth in the squat. Squeeze out. We'll recover. 10 seconds. And then we've got our sit. So we've got our drop and hold. Our pause round. Ready? Drop and hold. Pause. Hold it. Hold it there. I can feel my quads getting quite warm. I hope yours are too. 10 seconds, team. Come on, breathe through it. Five, four, three, two. Drive up out of there. Lose the bar. Or if you kill body weight, chill out. We've got our squat jumps. You ready? Three, two, go. Big kick. Big kick. So your chest is lifted. And again, use your arms to help get you off the floor. Soft, soft landing. So absorb it. Oh, my legs. Come on. Five seconds. Three, two, recover. Last block. So block five, sticking with the two to one ratio. 20 seconds of work, 10 second recovery. Ready to drop and pulse. Go. Drop and pulse. Oh. I can feel that now. Come on, stay with it. Knees out, feel the heat building. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Drive up out of there. Ten seconds. Oh, I'm feeling that. I lost you then, guys. I hope you carried on working. So, drop and hold for me. <laughs> there we go. We're going to stay here a little bit longer, just because you've got to love technology when it plays up, ain't you? Right, come up out of there. Right, you've got 10 seconds, and we've got our last round of squat jumps. What did you do during that broadcast fail? Did you carry on? Or did you go, what? Ready? Go, 20 seconds, squat jumps. Squat jumps. Oh. Last 10 seconds. And then you get one minute to recover. Oh, you swine. Right, me versus that. I'm about to kick off. Right. <laughs> if I lose you again, don't panic. I'll get you back. Right, take the recovery. We've got chest coming next. So chest, we're going to hit the floor. Exactly the same format. So we've got our press-ups. Hands go wide. Bottom half pulses. If you want to do it with the bar, lie down and bottom half pulses with your chest press. You've got 15 seconds. 15 seconds. 10 to go. Get ready to play, team. So bottom half pulses. Here they go. Three, two, one, go. Bottom half pulses. Stay low in the pulse. You can always do this on your knees if you need to. So if you want to, do it on your knees. If you'd rather, do it with the bar. Do it with the bar. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Recover. Take a breath. And then what happens next is we've got singles. So you've got 20 seconds, only 10 remaining. And then we go single press-ups. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go. Single press-ups, single press-ups. Or single press with the bar. Single press with the bar is also okay. Remember what we're looking for is the core to be braced tight. Don't let your hips drop. So do not let your hips drop. Recover. We've got 20 seconds and then we're going to drop and hold. So 20 seconds and then we're going to drop and hold. This is the one that's going to catch us. If you've got the bar, hold it at the bottom. Ready? Drop and hold. Chest to elbow crease every time. Chest to elbow crease. Come on, 10 seconds. Breathe through it. Breathe through it. Five, four, three. Two, we'll recover. Right, now the next round, this is the plyometric round. You've got two options. You can either press up and row, one elbow at a time, or you can try and press yourself off the floor. Ready? Three, two, go. So you can press up and row, 
Uh, or you can try and press it with two hands off the floor. If you've got the bar, get off and get onto the floor. Three, two, recover. One round down. We're doing that over again. You ready for the pulses? This round is going to get us big time. Ready team? In three, two, go. Bomb halves, bomb halves. Now I'm on my knees. No way can I do second round on my toes. If you're on your toes, keep going. If you're on your knees, keep going. And guess what? If you've got the bar, keep going. Three, two, recover. Right, we've got 10 seconds and then the singles are coming. Feel that. Do you think you can get any in on your toes? Don't try, don't know, right? Ready? Go. Single press. Single press. Real focus on keeping that cord braced nice and tight. Now remember you've got plenty of options. Try and take one before you bin it. Keep moving. Three, two, recover. Oh my life. It's the drop and hold round coming next. What do you say? <laughs> Big focus on holding it still. Five seconds. Three, two, go. Drop and hold. Come on. Chest to elbow crease and get your nose further forward than your fingertips. 10 seconds. Come on, team. Five, four, three, two, recover. Oh, my life. Plyometric. Press and row or press and get both hands off the floor. <laughs> what are you doing? 10 seconds. I don't know about you, but my arms are already shot. Ready? Go. So press and row one elbow at a time, or press and throw both hands off the floor. Soft elbows. Soft elbows. Come on, team. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, recover. Two blocks down. <laughs> you ready to go for block three, four, and five? Yeah, me either. Bottom half pulses coming your way. Bottom half pulses. And I bet you can guess what happens in block four and five, yeah? Here we go. Bottom halves, team. Bottom halves. Stay nice and low. Now, the reason why these bite so much is because we are exhausting the arms the muscles of all the oxygen. Getting the pump in the muscle. Three, two, one, recover. Give it a stretch out. We've got our singles coming, so we've got our play round. You ready to play? <laughs> Need five, four, three, two, go. Single press, single press. Now don't let your hips drop too low, but in the same respect, don't let your butt stick in the air. 10 seconds. Oh. Are you still with me, guys? Come on, don't bail. Three, two, recover. Oh, I don't know about you, this is getting proper tough now. Right, 15 seconds. We've got our pause round. You ready for this? So we're dropping and we're holding. In three, two, one, drop and hold. Come on, come on. Which is the worst round out of the four? Do we like the pulse, the play, this pause, or the plyo? Come on, 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, recover. Plyometric, are you in? You're very quiet guys, 
Have we lost the use of our arms? Five seconds. Here comes the plyometrics. So either row or both hands. Ready? Three, two, go. So press off the floor. Or row one elbow at a time. But look, the body doesn't twist. Keep the hips square to the floor. Five seconds. Four, three, two, recover. What does that leave us with? Block four and five. Now this round, 10 second recoveries. We've done it before, we've got to do it again. So bottom half pulses, then 10 seconds to chill. <laughs> I'm so charitable. You ready? Go, pulse, bottom halves, bottom halves. Big old burn, come on team. You got 10 seconds and then enjoy the 10 seconds of recovery. Oh, keep moving, five, four, three, two, recover. Right, 10 seconds and then we play. Single movement, oh, try not to smash the things around you. In, three, two, one, play, single press, single press. Now, can you feel your core? Are you activating it? Are you tensing it? And it's giving you a little bit of support. Come on, guys. Oh, five seconds. Four, three, two, recover. Ten seconds. Drop and hold. This is your pause round. Five seconds. Come on, guys. It's an awesome feeling. Cherish it. Drop and hold. Drop and hold. Oh, my arms. Please tell me you guys are moving. Come on, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two. Drive out of there. Well done. Plyometrics. Plyometrics to end block four. Get ready. Row or two hands off. In three, two, go. Five seconds down, guys. Come on, because you're going to get a minute after our last block. Ten seconds. Throw my hands up in the air. Three, two, recover. Ooh. Ooh. Right, you've got five seconds remaining, and then we're doing it over. Ready for the pulse round? Pulse in three, two, Bottom half pulses. Go, 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 go. Oh my life technology. Bottom half pulses. Are you still moving? Ignore the fact that I've just walked towards you. I'm just telling you off. Three, two, one. Recover. <laughs> Ten seconds. Single movements are coming. Ready? Three, two, one. Play with the singles. Play with the singles. Oh, come on, guys! Drive through the heels of your hands. Nice solid press ups. Five seconds. Is anybody still on their toes? Three, two, recover. It's the pause round, guys. Are you ready? Three, two, drop and hold. Come on, tense it, brace. Oh, breathe through it. 10 seconds, and we've only got one round remaining. Get that chest into check. Come on, five, four, three, two, drive out. 10 seconds, plyometrics coming your way. Oh, are you ready, guys? Go. Plyometrics, so either two hand take off or a single row. If you're rowing, take that elbow up towards the ceiling. Do not twist your body. Come on, five, four, three, two, recover. How are you doing? You still with me? Where have you all gone? <laughs> You got your minute, so come on, give me some sign of life, guys. So give me some sign of life. Are you still with me? 
Now, can it get any worse? Well, yeah, it can. Because we've still got legs to train. And we've got lunges in this set. Give yourself another 30 seconds. See, I'm being nice. Now, we've got two legs. So, guess what? <laughs> it's not pleasant. If you want it, get the bar onto the meaty part of your back. If you want to go pure body weight, you can. Oh, my life. Mate, I know, mate. <laughs> So we've got bottom half pulses in the lunge. Get ready to drop the back knee and pulse for 20 seconds. This, good news, bottom half pulse, go. It's because we've got two legs, we're only doing three rounds. Only doing three rounds. And to be honest, this workout might be a touch over half hour, <laughs> as of all of them this week. How bad? Right. Recover, changing legs, changing legs. I'm only gonna give you 10 seconds though because I don't wanna take up too much of your evening. Are you ready? Bottom half, pulse, opposite leg, opposite leg. Now that back knee should be about an inch away from the floor. Again, your elbows under the bar or if you haven't got one, chest is still lifted. Oh, drive through the front heel to get the most out of that glute. Three, two, one, come out of there. Right, change legs. 10 seconds. You so kind, aren't I? Single movement. My shoulders are shot after that. Singles. Go. So drop and top. All the way down, all the way up. Now I've got a nice 90 degree bend on my front knee. Not that you can see it, so I will do a side profile in a minute. And I'm making sure my knee doesn't go further forward than my toes. Three. Two, recover. Oh, almost took out the work. <laughs> right, other leg. Get ready for the singles. I hope you can see it from that side. Go. Oh, no, that's not going to work, is it? <laughs> Tell you what, forget that. <laughs> you got 10 seconds. Ah, hips towards the front, guys. Five seconds. Four, three. Two. Right, recover. Now, can it get worse? Yeah. We've got a drop and a hold. So we're going to take the bottom and hold there. You ready? Drop and hold. On paper, looks easy. You're thinking, just holding the bottom of the lunge. How hard can that be? In reality, you're probably thinking, I'm holding the bottom of the lunge. Why? Because we're getting our muscles to work a whole lot harder. They're having to stabilise and balance us. Up you get, change legs. Not nice, not nice. Ah! Are you ready? Drop and hold, drop and hold. Come on team, I hope you're smiling. <laughs> Everything is on fire, I know. Everything is. You've got 10 seconds. Come on, chest lifted. Five, four, Three, two, one, get out of there. Now guess what? We've got jump lunges. Yeah, I know. Three, two, one, 20 seconds of jump lunges. Come on, those legs should not be happy. Drive out of the front foot. Use your arms to get the height off the floor. Five seconds. Three, two, recover. Now I'm being very charitable. We're gonna have 20 seconds before we do that over. So enjoy the next 15 seconds because I'm still keeping the 10 second recoveries in between. Load the bar if you're gonna use it again. Five seconds, take a step back. Bottom halves, go. Bottom halves. How much do you hate me? Oh, shut up and dance with me. Ten seconds. Ooh, ooh. Five, four, three, two. Oh, change legs. How? Oh. Back heel should be lifted, and you should be in distress. Major distress. Pulse. Go. But so many merits to this training. It's 
So you're going to get your tone definition and some strength from. So you've got to just grit your teeth. Even when it turns bad, recover. Oh. Did I say three rounds? <laughs> Take a leg back. Singles, go. Singles. Oh. Drive out of that front heel. Get the most out of that glute. Oh. Oh, you're still with me, guys. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Change legs. Now, unless if you don't get any yellows and reds, we might. Maybe. Ready? Go. I hate lunges. Oh, 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 oh. Come on team, 10 seconds, shut up, five, four, three, two, oh, we've got our drop and start round, the pause, I don't want to pause, I don't want to play anymore, ready, go, drop and hold, hold it, think happy thoughts. What's your happy thought? Food? That's mine. 10 seconds. I'm sweating. Five, four, three, two, one. Get out. Whoa! Change legs. Hold on to down your back. It is hard, Charlie. Very hard. Ready? Sit. Get down. Hold it. Come on. Nice 90 degree bend in that front and back leg. Shut up! Whoa! Yeah, it's gonna be a little bit over. Probably got 45 minutes. Three, two, right, get up. Ditch the bar. Guess what? Oh, jump lunges. Jump lunges. Yeah. Ready? Go. Jumpy jump. <laughs> Come on, use your arms. Oh my life. Come on, 10 seconds and then again, it's going to be very charitable. Three, two, recover. We've got 20 seconds and then we're in our third round. Thankfully, only three rounds for lunges because we've got two legs. Oh my life. Five seconds, team. I don't know why I'm doing this for the third time round. Pulse, go. You don't have to keep the bar. Body weight alone will be more than enough. Ah. Come on, 10 seconds. Beautiful legs. Please. Ah, recover, change legs. That was the last pulse on one leg. We've got the last pulse on the other coming your way. Breathe. Ready? Drop and pulse. Make sure you're breathing. You'll go lightheaded if you're not. Oh, I don't know if I hit the ground, I ain't getting back up. Five, four, three, two. Oh, my life. I'm sorry for the noises coming out of me. I hope there's noises coming out of you lot. Leg back, singles, go. Push the knee away from you. Don't let it fold in, push it away from you. 10 seconds. Three, two, change legs. Don't worry if you're not having fun. I'm not. <laughs> Take the leg back. Drop in hot up. Singles even. Singles. Oh. Come on guys, I know it's a killer. But you've got this. 10 seconds. This takes us to halfway. Just over. Five. Four. Three. Two. Oh. Right. Drop and hold coming. Drop and hold. Set the leg, ready, 
Go, drop and hold. Freeze. Brace the core. Don't let your body start to fail you now. It's in your mind. Be strong. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, get out. Change legs. Come on, last drop and hold. And then we've got our jumps after this. Three. Ready? Go. Drop and hold. Remember your options, guys. Do not need the weight. 10 seconds. Then we get a minute after our jump round. Three, two, one. Oh! Jump lunges. Pull double over. Ready? Three, two, one. Jump lunges. Come on, 20 seconds. Oh, oh my life. 10 seconds. Option, step it, final five, four, three, two, recover. Now, I don't know about you, but I need a quad stretch. Hold on to the shin, push the hips forward. Now, we're about to hit our last round. If you're expecting 30 minutes, apologies, because we've actually got another eight or so minutes of training. So it's gonna push you towards 45 minutes. If you want a bell now, that's fine, because you've hit two, times on the legs and you've also hit your chest and biceps with a little bit of triceps we're isolating triceps now it is evil Lisa it's evil now I'm giving you a little bit longer because to be honest I need it too you've got options your options if you're using equipment you can use your single plate extensions if you haven't got equipment, no problem. Tricep press ups. Got a lot of So, bottom half pulses or bottom half pulses, singles, singles, and then our pauses were all on the floor. So, if you want equipment for the first two rounds, then the second two rounds you're going to hit the floor. Are you ready? Last block, team. Stay with me. So, you ready? Bottom half pulses, go. Hands directly under your shoulders. Option, do this on your knees. If you've got the plate, back of the neck. Little pulses. Nice straight lines. 10 seconds, guys. Three, two, one. Recover. Probably wondering what on earth this music is as well. Right, you've got 20 seconds. It's class, that's what this music is. I'm going to change it though. There we go, a bit of bed. Single press ups or single plate extensions? It's on you to decide. Ready? Go. 20 seconds. Now, again, whether you're on your knees or your toes for the press ups, don't let your hips drop. Make sure your core's braced tight and your elbows are pretty much grazing the side of your shirt. Woo, five seconds. Four, three, two, recover. Right, everybody on the floor, we've got a high plank hold. So we're on our hands for the plank hold. Get ready team. Hold plank, hold plank. So feet can stay narrow, because we're not moving. Make sure your shoulders are directly over the top of your hands. You've got 10 more seconds. Recover. Now your plyometric round a plank jacks and alternating shoulder taps. Your option is just to jack your feet and you don't have to tap. So go, jack the feet in and out. Jack the feet in and out. Your option is to tap opposite shoulders. 10 seconds, come on. Keep your butt down. Oh. Five, four, three, two, recover. 20 seconds, we're gonna go straight into block two. We've got our pulses. Come on, smashing it out of the park. Ready? Five, four, three, two, go. Drop and pulse, 
drop and pulse. Remember, you can always use the plate, tricep extensions to the back of the neck. Whew, I'm getting a sweat on. Drive out the heels of the hands if you're doing the press ups. If you've got the plate, little inch movements. Recover. Oh, that's pleasant. Not. So whether you've got equipment or not, it doesn't matter. The opportunity and the options are endless. Ready for the singles. In three, two, one, go. Single press ups, play. Over the cars, Ten seconds. shoulder taps or just the jacks or just the taps you choose ready for it go option is just step opposite and opposite so opposite arm and opposite leg or just jack the feet 10 seconds go on Zet. five four three two one recover right we're going to do one more, just the third round, we can't do the five, just because I don't want to take up air time for the other header. <laughs> so are you with me? Let's smash this. Triceps should be well and truly smashed by now. So ready for the bottom halves, in five, four, three, two, pulse, go. Bottom halves. Squeeze the elbows in. Come on. Remember, options are there. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, joy out. Oh, that's a beast. <laughs> when the four P's are not product, promotion, place, or price. No, <laughs> not in this workout. Right, we've got singles. Watch your face. It could be a face plant. Ready, go. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. And if you can't walk or brush your hair tomorrow, you know why. <laughs> 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, Recover. Just two rounds left, team. Come on. High plank and then jacks. Come on, arms. Ready? Hold it. Hold the plank. <laughs> Come on, 10 seconds. Three, two, one, drop it. Right, last one. This is 45 minutes of full on relentless training. Can you take it to the end? Let's do this. Ready? Jack and tap if you can. In three, two, go. Five. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so guys, 45 minutes 
of strength and conditioning. You may not feel like you've got any strength right now because it's all been taken out of you. But trust me, if you touch the muscles that you've just been working, they should feel rock solid. Please leave your feedback or complaints. <laughs> and uh, catch you tomorrow. Don't forget, you've got your catch up with me and boss in the morning. So uh, we'll have plenty to discuss, I'm sure. Well done, team. Check you soon.